Hi there! In this video, we're going to show you how to design your Elementor PDF templates, how to automatically generate PDF files from the submitted form data, how to attach these PDF files to users and admin emails. Let me show you an example. So, whenever a user submits the form from your website, you will receive this email from submission. Along with all information, you will also receive this PDF file. So, to enable this functionality, at begin, we need to install and activate the plugin. On your WordPress dashboard, go to Plugins Add New Plugin. In the search bar, typing PDF for Elementor form. Scroll down, you will see this plugin by addons.org. Click Install now. Activate the plugin. You can see it's already activated. After activating, navigate to the left sidebar. Click on PDF template, add new template. This is the template editor interface. First, we give the template title. Next, we choose a form to gather value fields. This is the form we created before. Let's save. And after saving, you will see all the form fields here. It helps you create a template with all necessary information. Let's go through the form. Here is the form preview. Now, get back to the template. Click here, we have some available templates. But now we start with a blank page. Navigate to Settings PDF to set various settings for the overall background. Adjust the DPI, choose the page orientation, select the size of paper, choose the font style, adjust the size of the text, specify the font color, Select header or photo templates. Add text or image to display as the watermark. Input any CSS to style the document further. Choose the background color or background image. Choose options for background repeat, size, position. Adjust the padding. Let's save to apply all the settings. First, insert the image for logo. You can upload it by choosing field or choosing from your computer or library. Center the image. Change the size of the image. Below, we insert a text for a title. Make it bold and bigger. Center alignment. Select a text color. Adjust the padding to remove some space. Add more text. Next, we also insert a text for form fields. 
To enter short codes, you can click here to copy or click here for quick. You can insert each form field, but now we insert all field. Insert one more text for contact information. Below that, we insert a QR code. In the QR code settings, set the desired content or short codes. Click Save and the QR code will appear. Center alignment or adjust the size of the code. We will put an image for the upcoming event schedule below. Change the size of the image. Adjust the padding. Now we've completed creating the PDF template. Save and have a preview. Now we will interpret this PDF with the form to automatically generate the PDF file. Go to the form. Scroll down at the action after submit menu. Click the plus icon. Choose PDF. Here you can create multiple PDF templates for this form by using PDF 2, 3, 4, and so on. Now we just use one. After selecting the PDF settings menu will appear here. Choose the PDF we created. Set the PDF file name. You can also set the PDF password, toggle the button to attach the PDF to email, then navigate to email settings. You can add the submitter email field here so they can receive the PDF after submission. Change the subject. Save and test the form. Fill out the form. Open the email to see. Click on this email. Here you can see, along with all information, you receive the PDF attachment. As admin, you can go to the elementor submission to view and download PDF files. It shows all information and the link to view and download PDF. The video stops here. Follow us to get new updates in the future. Thank you so much and have a nice day.